Recently, people have been asking us, what is an international notary or what is an international civil law notary? And I want to distinguish between the regular notary, where there are millions of, of, of people who basically just need a high school education, they, they, they take a small test, they post a, a very nominal bond for a few hundred bucks, and they can then notarize documents within their state. And so they become a notary in any state in the union, and they can notarize documents within their state, and they can't really go offshore very far because once they're in international waters, they're no longer in the state of, of that that's controlled by the laws of, of their state. And so in a typical real estate transaction, sometimes a banking transaction, sometimes legal documents, you have a notary, it could be an assistant, a secretary, it could even be a lawyer, who then you know, looks at your driver, driver's, a driver's license and determines, yes, that's who you are, and they, in fact, uh, uh, witness the, the, the transaction, and that's what a regular notary does. But the question is, what is an international civil law notary, or what is a civil law notary? And that is a very unique unusual type of notary that you have uh, in the United States. In Florida, there are only about 100. In Louisiana, there may be a, a, as many. Uh, and there are very few of, of us, uh, really, in, in the world. And uh, to become an international civil law notary in Florida, you have to be a lawyer for at least five years. You have to take a, a rather difficult course. And then you have to take a test that less than half the people pass. And more importantly, they only give the test two or three times every 10 years. But what an international civil law notary can do is that they can notarize documents anywhere in the world where the United States has, has diplomatic relations. And so typically when you are here in the United States and you need a document uh, notarized for your home country, a regular notary does not have the capacity to do that. But an international civil law notary does, and therefore you have no reason to actually go to a foreign consulate. Same thing, you have no reason to really go back to a foreign country uh, to get a document notarized by in that local country because an international civil law notary here in the United States can execute that document for you. They also can, uh, can marry people. They also can uh, witness various documents. They also can uh, help you uh, effectuate uh, powers of attorneys that, that typically would require notarization back in a foreign country here in the United States. And so typically, wherever you need a foreign notary uh, for a document, either here or abroad, you can use an international civil law notary. And what you can also do, which most people don't realize, is if you're buying a piece of real estate and you live abroad, typically you'd have to come to the United States to have your documents notarized. Or in the alternative, you'd have to go to the United States consulate, or maybe you'd be able to go to a, uh, a notary uh, in your foreign country. The alternative is you can also use an international civil law notary that may be in your country or that you may be able to, to arrange to visit with or to meet somewhere to have these documents executed. For example, I'm in Florida, but sometimes I'm in New York, and I'll meet clients from around the world in New York to have documents executed as a civil law notary so they don't have to go home uh, back to Europe or South America or wherever they have to go to have documents ex executed, and we'll actually do that uh, with them uh, right here in, in the United States. So international civil law notary is very unusual probably could be very helpful if you're in the real estate business, if you're in the investment business, uh, if you typically are, are requiring documents to, uh, to have uh, various uh, notarizations that are not the type that, that are typical uh, that you would normally have a regular notary execute.